Welcome back to Schweitzer Kids Church Online. Today is our final episode of the VBS Pep Rally Edition. Here's today's agenda. You can skip ahead or double back to catch the content you like best. We're so glad you've joined us here today. Today, we have some friends here to bring you the verse to live by. With man, it is impossible, but not with God. For all things are possible with God. Mark 10, 27. Thanks, ladies. This is Stephanie Taylor and Cindy Johnson, and they'll be taking the lead on kids' ministry this summer. We'll talk all about the difference you can make when you have confidence here today. This is Swipe Your Kids, bringing, bringing you the good news. news. something that you just don't think is right, but you don't really feel like you have the power to make a difference? Like everything you can do seems so small. Well, the really awesome thing is that with God, all things are possible. So whenever you're noticing something you want to change and you feel like what you're doing is too small, just know that God's working with you. And there's so many cool ways that kids have made a difference in this world. Hey, Nina, guess what? I'm feeling super confident because I'm known, I belong, I'm forgiven, and I can change. And now I just want to go out and make a difference in the world. Taylor, that's great. There are so many awesome things you can do to make a difference. Hey guys, have you heard of buddy benches? Hey Stephanie, no, no, no. What is a buddy bench? Well, there was a boy that noticed that sometimes kids felt lonely on the playground and he wanted to change that. So he asked his principal if they could put in a buddy bench. It's a bench that you can sit at when you're feeling lonely and the other kids will notice and ask you to come play with them. Whoa, that is such a cool idea. There's probably like thousands of kids now who don't feel lonely anymore and they're out there making friends and having fun. That's so awesome, what a cool idea. It's amazing what a big difference kids can make in their own schools. Hey guys, are you talking about kids making a difference in the world? Yeah, we were just saying how we can have confidence to make a difference. I just heard about this girl named Anna and she created a robot that goes around and picks up small pieces of plastic from the bottom of the ocean. Whoa, so she's helping save the fish? Like combing the water for all those tiny little plastics that are like impossible to get out? That's amazing. Yeah, she's just 13 and she's already making a difference by cleaning up the ocean. That is so cool. I love how we can do such big, amazing things when we have confidence and we work with God. Okay, so I'm thinking I can do something really big and exciting this summer, like host a VBS block party. Taylor, that's an awesome way to make a difference. Think of all the friends you can help see themselves the way God sees them, and then they can have such confidence. Hey, Taylor, where are you going? I'm going to invite the whole swim team to my house for a VBS block party. Taylor, don't forget your kit. It, it has everything you need for your party. Thanks, Nina. I can have confidence because I can make a difference. Awesome, let's go make a difference. On today's Ancient Technology Challenge, our contestants must correctly identify the name of each pictured data storage technology and the time period in which each was commonly used. Um, that looks like a... Oh, that's it. Oh, that's, I know a, that's, that's a tape. That's a cassette tape. Is what's the difference between those? Uh, one's in a case and one's in shrink wrap? Uh, more commercially used by 1978. I said 1990. 
All right, our next is the compact disc. CD. That's came out said. in 1982. CD was right. Aww. Um, following that is the DVD, which stands yeah. for Digital Video Disc. Yeah. From 1995. <gasps> I said 2001. I'm close. Move on to the USB flash drive. Yeah, yeah, I was correct. From 1999. Hey, I, I said 1990. And, uh, and we conclude with cloud data storage from 2000. I said the cloud. I said 2000. And I called it the cloud. <laughs> yeah. Well, yeah. I, I didn't say like the cloud behind it. Did that give me after Jesus had risen, he appeared to his disciples, and he told them, Go and make disciples of all nations, baptizing them in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. So for Jesus' disciples, these directions, known as the Great Commission, meant they were to go out into the world and share the good news that the Messiah had come and had saved everyone from sin. They were to go build the church. For us, it means the same thing. We can share Jesus' message of love and grace with the world. The Great Commission calls us to love like Jesus. When we live out the gospel message, we are compelled to love others as Jesus does. That means we love everyone as a person created in God's image. The Great Commission also calls us to serve like Jesus. People thought they were waiting for a great warrior king, but Jesus showed that he was a servant to others and even washed his disciples' feet. When we share Jesus' message, we serve others. And most importantly, in the Great Commission, Jesus calls us to share the gospel message. We are called to share Jesus with others in our everyday lives. You don't have to travel across the globe to be a missionary. You can share Jesus with people around you right where you are. It's amazing the difference one person can make. Remember this week, when you see yourself the way God does, you can use that confidence to do amazing things. So this week, I'm going to remember that I can have confidence to make a difference. As you're eating dinner with your family or lunch with your friends, I would like you to think about this question. What is something you'd like to help change in the world? What are some steps you can take toward that change? My check. One, two, one, two. Are y'all ready? Yeah. Are y'all ready? Yeah. Y'all ready? Yeah. Press play. Oh.
so much for joining us today. And remember this week. With man, it is impossible, but not with God. For all things are possible with God. Mark 10, 27. All right. If you want to sign up to host a VBS or be part of a VBS, go to sumc.co slash VBS. And remember, Jesus, Jesus loves, loves you and, and so, so do we. we. Let's go make a difference. Good. Okay. Nina, that's it. <sighs> You're done. This is Nina okay. signing oh, off. Wow. That is a serious wrap. I tell you.